National Mall Memorial Parks, Washington Monument, Pride and Excitement. Hello everyone, I'm Ranger Lauren, and today we're going to talk about the Washington Monument, one of our many monuments and memorials here at the National Mall. Have you ever completed a challenging task? How would you feel if it took 36 years to complete? That's how the people in this 1884 sketch feel about the completion of the Washington Monument. Let's take a closer look. 555 feet from the ground, six men stand on a wooden platform at the top of the Washington Monument. Do you see the man grasping the pyramid-shaped object on the top of the monument? No, this is not a heist, and that's not Indiana Jones snatching up another relic. It's the chief supervisor of the construction of the Washington Monument, P.H. McLaughlin. He's placing the aluminum apex on the top of the monument where it still sits today. This moment marks the completion of the monument over three decades after construction initially started. If you look at the gentleman to the right of McLaughlin waving his arms, that's Thomas Casey. He's the chief architect from the Army Corps of Engineers. Earlier the same day, he directed the placement of a large pointed capstone underneath the metal peak McLaughlin installed. The pulley system above the platform was used to hoist the 3,300 pound stone into place. To give you an idea, that's about the weight of a modern Volkswagen Beetle. Imagine you are on this platform with these engineers and workers and the wind is howling and you're maneuvering this huge 3,300 pound stone. I'd be a little nervous. I'd be worried I might lose my balance or I might crush my toes. Luckily, none of that happens. Did anyone happen to notice the man unfurling the flag or the two gentlemen on the left-hand side saluting? After the workers successfully lower the stone down into its resting place, a party ensues. Immediately, a celebratory 21-gun salute goes off. The American flag flaps in the wind, and at the 500-foot level, guests including dignitaries and monument construction workers strike up singing the Star Spangled Banner. Sounds of cheers can be heard from a crowd of spectators all the way at the bottom of the monument. Have you ever completed something that was difficult? Like when you do the last piece of a puzzle, pass a test you studied really hard for, or hike to the top of a mountain? Imagine if it took 36 years to accomplish these things. Would you feel excited and proud? While we are at home wishing we could visit places like the National Mall that connect us together. I'm hoping we can all feel a little bit of that excitement and pride the crowd felt when the monument was finally finished. Please take a moment to think about an achievement you are proud of and had to work really hard to accomplish. If you would like to share, write about it in the comments below. Photographs and prints courtesy of Library of Congress and Smithsonian Institution Archives. National Mall and Memorial Parks.